Six months ago, I began building an ecosystem, and what started as a simple project quickly evolved into an obsession. My creative urge was first tickled when I saw this sale for driftwood at PetSmart. I actually scored two pieces that inspired builds of their own on that run. The first order of business was to boil some of the tannins out of the wood which lowered the pH of the water. I got sponsored by Reptizoo who sent me the perfect terrarium. I built a drainage layer and a housing for the pump using aquarium divider grid before placing my driftwood. I secured this all together using aquarium safe silicone. I tied together the backdrop using expanding foam. Great stuff, the pond and stone version to be exact. Then added some cork bark to it while it was still sticky. I gave the foam 24 hours to cure and set to work with a razor blade shaving out the shiny outer bits. This way, section by section, I could coat it with more silicone and attach a cocoa peat sphagnum moss mixture. I let the tank gas off for 4 weeks and then I applied a wet moss mix that I got from frogdaddy.net. This coated the backdrop beautifully and gave me a nice green carpeting. I stole some plant trimmings from previous terrariums I built and also received a plant shipping from Frog Daddy. After planting everything I also introduced some tropical springtails which I also got from frogdaddy.net which will keep the tank clean. After letting that cycle for four more weeks, I introduced a trio of orange blackfoot poison dart frogs also sponsored to me from Frog Daddy. Check for the link in the comments if you want to see the full video.